Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Horde Control series. So, it's day 56, Horde's coming tonight. The base has been slightly updated since the last time. We've got more steel down here, a lot of the ground is covered in steel. I replaced all of the plates and all, all the damage they did has all been repaired. I didn't do too much to the base since the last time, like I said, with the exception of adding a bit of steel down around here, everything is pretty much the same. Uh, the turrets are reloaded and ready to go on this side here. We added a little bit of steel along there. Now I did uh, this wall up, this angle block here along the wall at the back there where the stairs are. I added a little bit of um, some steel to that. I didn't add it all the way around the other side because those stairs don't really get that damaged at all. But they did damage some blocks here so I put steel all the way along there. Everything out here has been repaired so uh, we've got our first set of um, electric fence running. Second set will come on halfway through the night. And then we got this SMG turret up here pointed down here if we need it. Um, sledge turret still the same turret. Uh, everything else is exactly the same. Nothing has changed. Um, <clears throat> now Anthony had mentioned maybe I should put a block out here so I could bounce grenades down here from, from my primary firing position. Problem with that is is sometimes the grenades will bounce way too far and they'll bounce out of like out of frame so that it misses the main horde of zombies like I could bounce it off here and down but you never know where it's gonna land right and the other thing too is that block might affect the zombies pathing um, like that one war 3 the war 3 ZUK mod I used I put barbed wire on the uh, walkway and it stopped them from pathing up the walkway so I don't want to put anything up on the top here I want to leave it nice and open like this uh, it's easier for me to shoot plus it's easier for them to see like a proper path to me besides this little opening here is working really really well we are having problems with the um, grenades and pipe bombs last time but I think it's this bar right here because it's actually out in the plate it kind of occupies this space right here it may be these bars I don't know for sure but, you know, we've got plenty of grenades tonight. We're going to test it out again. I think we'll be just fine. If I need to, I could probably angle it out a little bit more rather than in this way. We'll see see how that works. But uh, I've also got a rocket launcher for tonight. I built a rocket launcher. we got 11 uh, rocket frags. Got one in the tube and 10 here left over. So we're going to run that tonight. If it, if, it, if it looks really sticky and they're like they're right in here, we're going to quickly go to this and blow them up. Now, I don't know if we're going to get demolishers tonight, but I've loaded the... Uh, AK here with um, armor piercing ammo and if we do get them we're going to switch to this right away and try and kill them fast. Um, I'm interested to see if one of them went off how it would affect the base here but with all this steel I don't think it'll be so much of a problem and I mean I could I mean there's a few blocks down here I can actually add steel plates to that might help out but if they start going off it's going to be an issue there's not much I can do about it but um, yeah we'll just see how it goes. Hordes in like an hour game time so we'll see you then all right it's half an hour till horde in game so I just want to do a couple things really quickly here before we start uh, we're gonna have a look at our game stage and level so level 65 we only gained four levels since the last uh, recording game stage 144 we've gone up 13 I think since the last time or 11 or something like that and we got 2786 kills so I have to remember that number and see what we end up with at the end of tonight uh, I think we had 500 kills last time we'll see what we get this time uh, everything, all each of our weapons has a rad remover on it. We got 900 extra rounds for the shotgun, 1,200 for the tack rifle, and 583 extra for the AK. And like I said before, we got 11 rounds left for this. So um, yeah, I think we should be good. We're gonna go ahead and and stack up on our uh, skull crushers here. Did pick up a few more. I mean, we didn't do a lot of meleeing last time, but we might as well have that plus 50% for the entire night. And I do have a couple of things on me in case shit hits the fan. We need some first aid or whatever, but it's been pretty pretty easy the last few times. Got my coffee on me, eye candy for the end of the night, a little bit of food just in case we need it, in case we get our, set ourselves on fire if we use the Molotovs. So let's drink some coffee here. Does it stack? It does. There we go. Nine minutes. Got one left over just in case. Getting spit already. So it's probably from uh, the birds. Yeah. 
Come on, you bastards. So our shotgun turret ran completely completely out of ammo last time. That's how many um, birds and stuff it was shooting at. Come on, Mo. Ooh. So I put a rad remover on the club tonight, too. I figure we're going to be swinging a lot, so we might as well have that ready to go. I love this base design. It's so simple to do. Oh, there's a screamer already. At least I thought I heard the screamer. It seems to be working a lot better tonight than it was the other nights. I think the shotgun must be shooting at other zombies. Can't be all birds. It must be spotting them coming up the ramp or something. Ah, fry you bastard. Burn, baby, burn. I haven't felt the need to switch over to the shotgun yet. Although we should just try this out. That works pretty well. <laughs> Just the whole horde's gone. <laughs> Bang away, guys. Now, it looks like they're swinging at me when they're being electrocuted. But I think it's just an animation. I don't think they're actually swinging because I'm not getting hit. Come on, you guys. Let's go. Team me up. Not getting any cops this time either. Well, there's a level.
three power attacks to the head. That radiator was still going. Oh, I got a hit. All right, are we losing the first wire? Nope. Not yet. Two hours into the night, one third of the way done. Probably should check these bars, but I don't think they're taking much damage. Look at this mayhem, man. Okay, they broke through the first one. First wire, that is. Alright, let's clear some of these guys out down here. Get the rest of them. We're going to switch to the shotgun for about 40 minutes. And then we'll throw the second uh, wire on. So I made a new shotgun. Rather than having seven rounds, it's got nine, which actually makes a difference. All right, let's clear these guys out. Whee! Oh, man. That should get all the radiated ones, too. How many, how many rounds we got left? Six rounds. That ain't bad. Ooh, he got me. Wow. He got me. Not shot. Where are they going now? Oh, damn it. I don't know what they're doing over there. Yeah, all the radiated ones just get right back up. Uh, let's turn that second one on now. <laughs> I turned it on just in time to let you keep this guy. <laughs> Come on, you punk. I'm right here. Stand there and die. All right. Should have brought more coffee. It's the one thing I should have done. No demolishers yet. Good amount of radiators, though, over the last time. Come on, you bastard. Do I got to thin you out again? I think I do. 
clear these guys out of here and then we'll thin them out. Alright, let's send them out. Let's go with these because they're cheaper. Come on, you bastards. They're getting all green now. Look at them, they're still going. Oh, you want some more? You want some more? Ooh, the dog got a piece of me. Yeah, they haven't broken through that first layer of bars yet. I haven't even checked them. It's over, it's two thirds of the way through the night. Even if they break that first set of bars, they won't break the second set. They just don't have the juice. What's up, Tex? First time I've seen you here. Oh, they got a piece of me. Alright. You guys want to play games? We can play games. All right, time to thin him out again. Go with a grenade this time, though. That one bounced. We need to use this? No, we don't. We're good. God, I'm popping these guys' heads like this. All right, let's clear them out. Yeah, they've broken through the, some of the plates down there. But not anywhere near close to taking this place down. I think their only hope is bringing demos in. Oop, wrong gun. Alright, so that... Alright, about right on time, that second layer of, uh, wire is down. I think we can drop one of these right in here. There you go. 
Getting a little laggy now, too. Got four shots left. Alright, see how many more show up. Come on, you bastards. Get up here. Ooh, they got me in the knee. Who was it? That, uh, that was the, uh, the spider, I think. Yeah, this close one is working. I think I need to add one more layer. Or worst case, add another um, wire on the second layer out. Because that's really the one that's keeping me alive, I think, for the most part. Still not through that first bar yet, and I haven't even, touched, I haven't even repaired them. Get back over here. Wow. And yet, still some of them get back up again, eh? Come on, you guys. And there's the morning. We'll see how many of these guys are left. Can't be that many. That grenade took a lot out there, that lot. Oh, pair of shorts, wonderful. Come on, you bastards, get up here. Sounds like a couple of them left. Let's go with the armor piercing rounds, we'll just kill these guys fast. I think that's it. I don't hear anymore. So, we barely went through any ammo at all. Not even a full stack of this. Not even a full stack of this. One full stack of shotgun in a little bit. So, like, no ammo. Uh, we used 9 grenades. We used 12 pipe bombs. And I think we used all we used not, uh, nine rockets, and that was it. So, like, honestly, and we'll be getting our ammo back probably from these piles. Oop, I should be doing this first. Use that. Let's use some water, and let's put one of these in us, just in case we get some guys showing up. Got a third. We got a thirty-minute abrasion too. We'll get that fixed up here in a second. Alright, so that's it. Now, let's see how much damage they did to this this uh, thing here. <laughs> 300 points, that's all they were managed, they, all they managed to be able to put on these bars all night and I didn't even repair them. And like 7 points in the bottom set. Now, they did a good job on this. I think a lot of this was me too. But that's really nothing to repair. <laughs> it's like 4 pieces of steel and 1 there. So like nothing. I mean, I ca what? Oh, about a thousand damage to each of these. Not quite a thousand. I'm out of steel. That's the steel I had from the uh, thing, but like nothing. No real damage at all. Now, down here, it might be a different story. Now, these stairs, they're all steel, so that lasted fine. The plates didn't get knocked out. None of these got knocked out, although they did do a little bit of damage to this. Not much. Nothing under here. All the plates remain intact. This piece lost its steel. And we lost one plate here and the steel off of this plate and that's it. Oh, and this this piece of steel here. So plate and steel. So like nothing. It really is zero damage to this base. Now I'll have to go through and repair all these blocks with steel, but 
I should be able to make at least, you know, six or seven hundred pieces of steel between now and the next episode. They didn't touch anywhere back here. They don't they don't even go back here, you know? Oh, they did a little bit of damage to this, but that's just one block. Wow, I hear somebody banging. Oh, it looks like we had a wandering horde last night too. Alright, well, that's it for this episode. Let's have a quick look here. I picked up a level 5 machete. That's great. Steel shovel, finally. Uh, we've been working with iron for the past little while, but we've got a level 5 steel one here. Tons of stuff that I can repair and sell. Um, we made a lot of brass, so we easily made our ammo back that we used up. With the exception of shotgun ammo. And that's about it. We've got a book that we never had. Nice. All right. Let's have a quick look at our game stage, and then we're out of here. All right, game stage 146. So we went up two levels. I mean, <laughs> what, two levels? That's nothing. Enemy kills. So we were at what? We were at 2786, I think it was, wasn't it? 2780-something? So, yeah, I mean, about, what, 550? 560? No. 570, roughly. 570 kills. So it's about the same. I think the rocket launcher helped out with that. So we'll make a lot more rocket ammo next time, but no demolishers. This base will really be standing. It's uh, proving its worth when the demolishers show up. All right, so I'm ending this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you on day 63.